So last week's experiment, I'm going to get a video ready here in the background, but we were looking at do leafs breathe? We were looking, we know about photosynthesis. We know that leafs take carbon dioxide and sunlight and they turn it into energy in the form of glucose and oxygen. But for some people, that whole thought of plants breathing, exchanging gases, it's hard for them to visualize because plants move at a different time scale than us. They, it's much slower, but it's no less dramatic. It just happens at a rate that we're not used to seeing. So in our experiment, we try to take a look at leafs, plants, breathing. So let me play a video here and I'm gonna show you my results uh, and we can talk about what I saw here. So there we go. I had multiple examples. One here was this coniferous or evergreen tree, this cedar. And you can see this video uh, was within minutes of me finishing the event that day, the Darwin 200 event. You can already see bubbles of oxygen coming up from uh, the leaves uh, of this cedar tree. So within minutes, it was you could already see the oxygen bubbles being produced uh, and bubbling up from down below. So that was really cool to see. Now, I also had two different types of plants. I had a hosta and I had a maple leaf. And then I had a leaf that had fallen off of the tree. So this was the hosta after about an hour or two. And you can see all of these little bubbles that have formed. Here's the maple leaf. And again, if you take a look at the screen, you can see all the bubbles of oxygen that the leaf is releasing. Here's the cedar again. You can see it is still after a couple hours. You can still see some bubbles uh, on those leaves. So two different leaves, coniferous or conifers, um, and then the deciduous that fall off. Here is one that had turned red. It had fallen off the maple tree. And you can see there's no uh, oxygen being produced because that leaf is, you know, released from the tree. It's no longer part of the living tree. So gases aren't being exchanged. So really cool experiment, uh, seeing that oxygen being produced, seeing that photosynthesis. So um, sunlight uh, and carbon dioxide being converted by the plants, the trees uh, into sugars like glucose uh, and then uh, oxygen, which is released into the air. And as you know, we're breathing it right now. It's pretty darn important. So there we go. That was our experiment. Uh, plants breathing. We saw proof of that gas exchange. How do they do it? Well, they have little guard cells called stomata on the underside of the leaves. Uh, and those guard cells are filled um, with water. If they want to close those cells, they take the water out of the cells and they tighten up and close. If they want to open those stomata, those guard cells, water comes into those cells and they bulge and that opens uh, that pour, that space for water um, and oxygen to leave from the leaf. Pretty darn cool.